Lil Transgender Shop Sells Fake Penises for Little Girls The mother of a young transgender is selling fake penises for little girls. Her website, transkids.biz, offers products ranging from tiny silicone penises in circumcised and uncircumcised models, genital pack holders and transgender books for kids. Trans Kids is run by Sa, who also runs a site for trans guys called Fmessentials.com says the About Us page featuring a pink-haired proprietor. After years of helping adults find high-quality gender expression gear, she saw the need for a site and store that focused more on kids and their unique needs. Sarah is also the parent of a young transgender girl, so she hopes that all parents coming here can trust that this is a safe and affirming place, where helping your kids live fully is our main goal. The fake penises are designed for ages 8-13 according to the product page. This is the smallest stand-to-pee device that we have seen, it states. Designed especially for younger folks, ape rocks. 8 13 years old, these are discreet enough that they can be worn all day under clothes. If your child was assigned female at birth but wants to stand up while urinating, this just might work great for them. The store underscores how young children are increasingly being pressured to reconsider their gender identity which critics have blasted as a form of child abuse. What I'm concerned about is the popularity and the availability of sex reassignment surgery to someone who doesn't feel that he or she belongs to the biological birth gender, and people, particularly parents, are being encouraged to intervene in the process, said liberal author Camille Paglia. Parents are now encouraged to subject the child to procedures that I think are a form of child abuse, either with hormones to slow puberty actual surgical manipulations, etc. But there's another factor at play, estrogen mimickers in household goods and groceries, especially bisphenol A, BPA, in plastics as well as foods with highly processed soy ingredients, both of which are said to contribute to the low testosterone soy boy pandemic. Bisphenol A, BPA, in particular is known as the gender-bending chemical because of its link to male impotence and low sperm counts. Estrogen mimickers increase estrogenic activity in young men, leading to social anxiety and bitch tits, so it is really surprising that there's a generation of celibate hipsters running around in skinny jeans who are scared to death of fist fights and women, and women, 